Hey, Tyron, can you get my phone out of my bag so I can get a photo for my Instagram? Yeah, it's in my bag. Yeah, no, that's... I got that $20 out on the way here. You saw me. This morning I said... When I said I didn't have any money this morning in the subway, I didn't. I just got it out on the way here. Karen, why are you being so bitchy? I helped you get a photo earlier, and you even helped me get rid of my new smoker mask. In today's video, we are diving into some online shopping for a full face snorkel mask so we can then build an atmosphere supplying respirator to protect us from bad smells. This is going to be pretty casual. You know it's going to be casual because I'm sitting down. So I'm making a papar, a papar, powered air purifying respirator used for anything with heavy chemicals or some nasty viruses. So generally you have the little motor on the back it's going through some filters, that's drawing the air in, and it pumps it through to your face, and there's, pos there's positive pressure. But instead of having filters on the back and a hose going up to your head, you're gonna have that hose going all the way outside the shed so it gets nice, clean garden air, brings it into my face. So what we need is some kind of mask that covers a whole face. The idea is a snorkel mask, because you've got those new ones that cover the whole face, this is not an advertisement for eBay. Mask, see straight away, full face mask has come up, about $19. Soft, non-toxic silicon, cool, so we can eat it. But look at the view. Fish have never been so distorted. You would yak every few minutes looking through something like that. Oh, look at the colors, yes. Oh yeah. You're not wearing that mask. <laughs> Daddy, there's a monster in our pool. It's like a big blowfly. I'm a water blowfly in your pool. I'm gonna feed on you when you swim in your pool. Oh yeah, love this one. It's like they've printed out her face and then just glued it into the mask, then filled it up with 7up. Thumbs up, everything looks nice and yellow. This looks medical. <laughs> Is there something stuck to my head? Looks like a perfume bottle has been superimposed on her face. Just hanging out with my new mask. 180 degree weight, shint. So what else we got? Oh geez, double barrel. <laughs> what the hell? Some sort of antelope. Oh, now we got arrows and molecules. Good stuff. I could be that happy. I could be that happy in the pool with handlebars stuck to my face. It looks completely stupid, but it's interesting. The difference between these and a normal snorkel like if you want to talk to someone, you just kind of spit the thing out of your mouth. Normally, with this, you got to be like, Hey guys! Alright, so I found this one. This looks pretty good. $26. Alright, a few different sizes. See if we can get something to get around my jaw. Let's go large or extra large. This guy down the bottom right here. Look at these mates going. Hey guys, let's try out my new, my new snorkel mask. I'm and snorkeling. I don't think they've got the uh, scale right there. We've got this girl up the top here as well. Hey boss, today my new size last style with mask has got a proper bus on top. How so my snorkeling mask? Are you still planning to use the traditional diving mask? Probably, I've had one for 20 years. Do you find it hard to adapt to breath via mouth and have had enough sore jaw and swallowing water? This jaw does get sore. If so, it's time to buy a full face snorkel mask which allow you to breath easily via nose and mouth. Traditionally, I've been breathing through my asshole. No more worries about all these problems. All you need to do is enjoy the snorkeling trip. Ha, <laughs> good times. All right, wait for this to rock up, suss it out, see what we're gonna do. It has arrived. Ooh. So this is what we got to work with. Decent strap at the back. Rubber on the inside. Feels pretty good. It's quite a long seal, so that should um that should do nicely. It looks apart. It looks like a respirator. Before these were invented as snorkels, you would think this is a respirator. We'll probably be attaching our pipes straight to this awkward oval shape. <laughs> See someone follow me around. Like this one. You got this earlier? 
Just, just go up through the bottom. That's my thigh. That's my thigh. Ah. Oh, holy. That's a weird sensation. Yeah, when you exhale, it blows straight into your eyes. <laughs> ah, I think I think the air needs to be. Probably, you probably can't hear. <laughs> Keep laughing at the sound of your breathing. Okay. <laughs> okay, breathing out normally is okay, but when I laugh, it projects into my eyes. <laughs> I don't know why it's such a weird feeling there is. I don't think I've learned something like this before. I feel more protected from viruses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The valve sounds like it, get, it hits a resonant frequency in my voice. What's vibrating? But it doesn't fog. You feel it trying to fog up and then boom! You suck your own air in it. Gets rid of it. What if I block that? What's going to happen now? What you going to do, huh? Hey Kristen, want to see my new hockey mask and chainsaw? I can't even hear what you're saying. Oh, it's so wet in there. It kind of makes... <laughs> <laughs> no, it's... Can you wipe, oh. wipe that down? Oh, yeah. That gets a lot of oh. condensation oh, no, in it. I don't think I can do it. <laughs> what do you reckon? It's amazing. Oh, yeah, it is hard to hear. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> it's really good. It's weird. Now, exhale really hard. To go in your eyes? Yeah. Probably work better on you because you got no beard. I reckon my beard's gonna let the water flow, flow forth. <laughs> Just taking it all in. Blast. Breathe. Don't block it. <laughs> see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Breathe. Breathe. Yeah. Breathe. <laughs> You're fighting it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you ready? <laughs> it's, it's what happened. <laughs> it's the worst kind of cupcake. Because, because it's the flat mask and you've got this hard edge around here, your peripheral or the bottom of your view is quite distorted. So everything's, everything's fine up here. But then, you know, where your feet are moving and, and like the, the desk here in front of me, that's all quite blurred, like double vision blurred. That's a bad thing. Okay, the other problem which is more of a concern is this, this valve here isn't sufficient for exhaling. So some of the air is somehow getting back out and coming out here. And that's, that's not much of a problem if you're snorkeling and you've got a snorkel that's only this long. But if you've got a hose that's eight meters long, that's gonna get a bit of CO2 in there. So that might be a bit of a problem. But if we've got a motor pumping the air in, we're not just sucking it in with our lungs. Hopefully that'll counteract it, thinking about it. We just need enough positive pressure pushing in. <sighs> Let's try it in the pool, then we'll work out what our plan is in the shed and get into it. So I ended up trying it on in the pool. It actually works pretty good as a snorkel mask. Surprise, surprise, there's a nice wide field of view. When you dive down though, I don't like how it crushes your face. That's a bit of a problem, but we're going to pull it apart and turn it into something else anyway. And that's what we'll be doing in the next video. Perhaps support this channel by subscribing and I'll catch you guys soon. The next video will be up pretty quickly as well. So keep an eye out for that. Catch you later. Ah, 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 ah,
Ah, vale. Ah, eh, eh.